All right, hello everybody. Um, just a real quick video here of the answers for week three Survivor Series. Um, and you guys have requested that I give you the answers. Please just don't uh, get with each other to see how everybody's done. Just keep it to yourself. That's part of this uh, team thing for Survivor. Um, so that, here we go. Here's the questions and the answers. Number one, how many years of your life will you spend in the bathroom? And the answer is A, seven. Unless you're a bathroom attendant, then you're gonna spend more. So, answer is A, seven for number one. And Debbie, um, with you just getting voted off, I think if you would've went with what you would've thought the answer would've been instead of your personal experience, um, you might've went to a tie and uh, had to build fire with somebody on that one, so. Um, Try not to go with per personal experiences. Go by Debbie's mistake there. Um, number two, the tribute to dad. How many squares are there in a bingo card? And the answer is B, 25. <clears throat> number three, had a video for. Um, how many black keys are on a standard piano keyboard? And the answer is uh, C, 36. All right, and then number four, the weird state law. Um, on Sunday in Florida, it is illegal for a single woman to do what? And the answer is D, skydive. Um, number five, what is the toughest man-made polymer? Um, a, Kevlar. Um, number six, this is the one that I kind of liked. I would have never guessed this. Um, had a video for it. Um, who composed the music for Sonic the Hedgehog? And the answer was B, Michael Jackson. I um, had another video for number seven, and I don't know why, I just, uh, I like watching these videos of jellyfish because I think jellyfish are so cool. Um, just watching how they just like, there's like hardly anything with them, and they just move around like they do. Um, number seven, jellyfish have no stomach, and the answer is false. Jellyfish have no brain. Um, number eight, Another weird state law for Florida, like I said, I picked on Florida. Um, what is banned in Florida after 6 p.m. on Thursday? <laughs> and the answer is C, farting. I think uh, if I'd have known that when I was down in Florida, I'd have probably got arrested because I'm sure I had enough gas down there eating uh, restaurant food all the time. Um, number nine. Which of the following states was part of the Northwest Territory? And the answer is D, Ohio. So it's, it's kind of uh, strange how the Northwest Territory reached that far east to use Ohio as part of their territory. But that is along with Wisconsin, Indiana, Illinois, Michigan, and part of Minnesota too. So <clears throat> number 10, how did the term soccer mom come about? And this was the gimme, which you better have got it right. And the A, it, or the answer is A, mom signed their kid up, kids up for as many activities as possible. And I kind of looked this up a little bit. I'm just, I never really said. Uh, I'm assuming it's just to keep kids out of trouble. So was, they figured as many activities they put them in, uh, the less chance they had to get in trouble. And no, it wasn't D. There was a fight between moms and a kid said, soccer, mom. All right, so that is the answers for week three um, Survivor Series. And remember, uh, for week four, Heather or Colby has to sit out. Brian and Steve sat out last this week for week three. Um, Debbie's gone now. The torch got snuffed. Um, be looking for immunity talismans um, they come in any different shape or size so it's not going to be the same thing every time might be in there for a few weeks might be in there the whole season and it might only show up for one week so you just got to be watching <clears throat> for the talisman all right saturday night enjoy your weekend i guess the next time i'll be talking to you guys is monday we'll see you